We're staying on top of the ongoing baby formula shortage. It's been weeks since an official update on this shortage came from federal officials in the capital. Yeah, the data from industry experts shows a 30% out of stock rate across the country. That means less formula on the shelves and more families struggling to keep their babies fed. One family in Snohomish County has turned to breast milk, but now they're struggling to find a long-term donor for that. In just two or three days, this family will run out of their current supply of milk for their six-month-old girl. Again, and this all connects back to the formula shortage, pushing more people to try anything and everything they can. And Fox 13 News reporter Jennifer Lee brings us the family's cry for help tonight. <laughs> Mom and dad say Starlin is a happy baby, full of laughter and loves to smile. But behind their happy faces are also fear and worry. She is six months and um, just a couple days. <laughs> Shayla Pruitt says they were getting by with a few steady donors, but a couple just moved away, and their last remaining donor is supplying milk to four or five more babies. They're trying baby food once a week, but their daughter has a hard time keeping it down. As we have tried formula, and she will absolutely not take it. We have got her to where she'll take um, one-fourth of the bottle of formula mixed with three-fourths breast milk. Pruitt believes the ongoing formula shortage is driving up demand for breast milk. Same with breast milk. It seems harder than it used to be because a lot of parents are struggling with their babies taking formulas, and so they've been searching for breast milk as well. The family is praying for a long-term donor and says they're willing to drive anywhere from their home in Darrington. We do need some breast milk, so if it is possible, it'd be highly appreciated. Um, we've, we've gone through quite a bit already, and with it being in such high demand, it's kind of kind of hard to keep getting as much as we need it's a it's a struggle if anyone wants to be a donor or has some milk some breast milk to donate um we would gladly take it we are willing to travel anywhere in washington at this point just to be able to feed our daughter it's been very hard and we appreciate anything jennifer lee fox 13 news well, the family says they've been posting on a Facebook group called Washington Human Milk for Babies, and they say they'll continue to be proactive in their search.